welcome back to another Burt's Bees review. So this one is a nice brand new one that just came out recently. Not the newest one. The newest one I'm still waiting for to get in stock. They listed it on the site. There's a peach one. I needs it. But um, it's not available yet. But I do have Kiwi Melon. So, anywho, we are going to go ahead and open this up. So, on the back, it just says, Hydrating shea butter and nourishing vitamin E mingle with the flavors of juicy kiwi and fresh melon for a sweet, summery treat. So, let me go ahead and pop this out for you. I am in freaking love with the aesthetic on this, let me just tell you. So, let me... Okay. Got the sticker the rest of the way off, because I wasn't sure if I was gonna film... Or take a picture of it before I filmed with it, so I kind of kept the sticker in place, even though I definitely already did like a little surprise sneaky peek of the scent, but anywho. So, it looks like this. You guys know how I feel about this color, I absolutely love it. I'm like, ah, it couldn't be more perfect for me if they tried, unless it were like bright turquoise, but anyway. So here it is. I'm very, very excited. So that's the packaging. Uh, Price-wise, it's like all the normal Burt's Bees. It's like about four bucks. Uh, it's 0.15 ounces standard stick amount. Good cap. No wiggly turn wheel. It's just ticking all of the boxes. It is organic. Our ingredients on this one are... Sunflower seed oil, coconut oil, beeswax flavor, castor seed oil, lanolin, kiwi fruit extract, melon fruit extract, shea butter, cocoa seed butter, safflower seed oil, soybean oil, coffrol, robotocide A, benzyl salicylate, cinnamol, hexyl cinnamol, limonene linalool. And that is it. So, tis organic. It's not part of a set or anything, it's just a standalone not medicated, no SPF, no special features, so the part I know you're all waiting for, you want to hear what it smells like, so. Oh, I love this one. I've had enough willpower not to put it on yet, because I was waiting for this video, but the smell though, oh my god. It's definitely more on the melon side than the kiwi side. I would even venture so far as to say it kind of smells like the Bath and Body Works cucumber melon. I don't really get kiwi out of this. Maybe once I put it on I'll get kiwi, but this kind of just smells like cantaloupe. Maybe even honeydew. Yeah, it's honeydew. It's not cantaloupe. I take back what I said. It's not cantaloupe. It's honeydew. So anyway, I'm gonna put it on. I'm really excited. <laughs> Okay. Oh, I guess there's a little kiwi in there. Especially when you smell it that way. I really get the kiwi out of it, but when you smell the stick, you mostly get the melon. That's so freaking weird, but I like it. Oh my god, it's so good. This may be one of my favorite ever Burt's Bees, like, straight up. There is a flavor. I'm trying to pin down what it tastes like. I think it's very, very subtly melon flavored. Thickness wise, it's on the thinner side. It's not the thinnest I've ever tried, but it's not as thick as some Burt's Bees, so. Um, but that said, it's hella creamy, not sticky. Um, very smooth. I don't feel any chaps through it, which is amazing, and I love that. Most Burt's Bees, I seem to find that true of. Not all, but a lot. Um, if it's like any other Burt's Bees, it's going to do a great job hydrating. So let's see, is it shiny? It is shiny! Hell yeah! Okay. Here for it. Love to see it. Let's see how it does with the drink test. Passed it with flying colors. All right. 
All right. I don't think I had a single complaint with this one. Not a one. Perfect 10, babies. Perfect 10. We have barely given any of those out this year so far. I think we've only given out two. Now we've given out three. <laughs> oh, I love this one. If you don't have it yet, you need to get it. It is so good. Uh, if you're a little iffy because of the Kiwi, don't be. Because like I said, the Kiwi is basically a background player. It's there, but it's very subtle. It's mostly the melon. So if you like melon scents, it's not the same as the watermelon, though. It's definitely like honeydew. So if you like the idea of that, grab yourself this one because, oh my god, it's so good. Anyways, that is it for this one, my dudes. So as usual, you know what to do. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a like. If you're not already and you'd like to be, click subscribe. Hit that notification bell icon so you never miss an upload. Leave comments down below. Make sure you're following my social media accounts, my Facebook fan page, my Twitter, my Instagram, my Etsy, everything and more. It's all down below. And if you'd like what I do here on this channel and you'd like to help support it, the donation link, as always, is down in the description. Anyway, guys, till next time, see ya.